Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to another Haiti video. In this video, we're going to be talking about the March special offers that are spring related. These are no diamond deco packs. You can see there's a bunch of decorations that we're getting. So let's get right into the game and start talking about these decorations in detail. Let's go. Okay, so I'm in the game and I'm just going to do a little gameplay first, then we'll get right into the decorations. So let's just harvest some crops first. I've got some mushrooms and wheat ready to be harvested. Whoops, my silo just got full. But let's check what my bonus materials are going to be. Gosh, I literally forgot. Today is the worst even in the history of the world. Oh, uh, this crops bonanza even I hate so much. Can we please get this removed? I don't know why I hate it. Even put this even, you guys. I really don't understand. I'm sorry. Um, and I'm even sorry if you like this even because I don't. So, yeah, just don't get me wrong, though. It's just my opinion. Okay, so I think that... Oh, my God, I have a lot of rice. I have a lot of rice, which is not bad. I can make sushi. So maybe I would convert these rice into some sushi. Yeah, I do need a bunch of... Let's make four uh, sushi rolls. Okay, great. I put uh, four sushi rolls, and now I'm going to see what else do I have. So I have a lot of corn, and I'm sure no one's going to purchase it if I sold it for max price, because the paper is literally going to be filled up with lots of crops. Yeah, as you guys can see, uh, this is a whole disaster. I knew this was going to happen. Sometimes I wish that I stopped playing the game when this event's going on. I can't play. I just don't like this event, you guys. I hate this event. So, let's just fill my crates. I need more tomatoes. Whoops, I don't have any. I'll do them. Oh, we can collect our farm pass perk. That's nice. There we go. I'll be able to ask for help on more crates, I think. Yeah, let's do this. And I'm going to ask help like this. Yep, someone will do. I hope so. I don't know. Let's collect our honeycombs, and I'm just going to collect my squirrels over here. Someone donated me a bunch of iron bars, so thank you to everyone who donated. You guys are so awesome. Let me just collect my dairy products, and I need to make more dairy items. Let's go with a bunch of cream and butter. Here, I'm just going to collect some bread, and yeah, let's make more bread. All right, and before making the bread, I think I'm just going to wake up my pets that they're sleeping. Yay, it's time to get a lot of XP and also a lot of expansion materials. I love when I wake up my pets. It's a great time. So let's see what I get. My barn's getting full, by the way. And the milk and bacon that I'm using to feed my pets, it's not getting used from my stock. It's actually getting used from Rose stock. So that's the only down part of, you know, hiring Rose. But overall, she's great. I really don't have any regrets. Okay, uh... And then, of course, my peacock and my donkeys. So that was a lot of materials, and my barn's almost full. I don't have a lot of space left, just so many tools. Maybe I'm just going to put some ores that I don't need. And let's just sell some winter veggies. Oh, the winter veggies. What a weird name. I thought it was going to be something like vegetable salad or something, or just the, the cooked veggies. I don't know. Um, but why it's called the winter veggies, though? Was it added in the winter? Um, let me check, though, you guys. Let me have a look at this, um, product. Uh, the winter veggies. Yeah, it requires beetroot, potatoes, carrots, and pumpkins. I don't know what's so special for the winters. Maybe beetroot? Because, I don't know. Anyways, so no one's held my boat yet. And can I just harvest my crops now? Can I do it, please? I really want to harvest all my crops. Don't tell me I can't. Nope, still can't. Barn's full. Um, have a lot of rice. Let's just make some rice noodles. All right. I make a lot of rice noodles. So what you have to do during this event, make sure that you only plant the crops that are really important. You don't have to plant a lot of um, corn, wheat, or even the carrots and soybeans because you'll find a plenty in the paper. So don't waste your time hanging around carrots and soybeans. You guys can see there's a bunch of carrots in the paper. So just plant the crops that are important, like tomatoes, tea leaves. You can make extra money with all these crops during this event. Anyways, I think I won't be able to do any other thing, you guys, because my barn and cellar are almost full, except I can just make some uh, sauce items. Yeah, I can. So now 
Talking about the decorations, you guys can see, you guys can see on the top right corner of the screen, there's three in red, which means there's something unusual going on. So I'm going to be tapping on this part, and there we go. Now, there's a bunch of new things. I'm having a special offer, which is another special offer about a 16% discount. I'm getting a Rhino hedge. Um, there's a bunch of time tools for 2,000 rupees, which is not worth it. I'm not going to get them. And talking about these decorations, okay, hold up, you guys. This video is going to be a little different because I personally, this time, do not like these decorations. I literally don't, and I think they're not worth purchasing with your real money, you guys. Please remember, this is just my opinion, and this is just my point of view. You might like these decorations, you might purchase them, but I don't. And this is probably going to be the first time when I'm not going to purchase any decorations. So what we're getting, actually, we're getting... There are three offers as usual. In offer number one, we're getting five flower fences. In offer number two, there's one flower gnome. And in offer number three, there's one flower gnome and five fences together. Now, why I'm saying that this is completely trash, I really shouldn't say trash. I mean, it's still a decoration. Um, or it's not like worth it in my opinion. It's because, first of all, fences, I don't purchase fences. You guys know anytime there are some paths or fences, I skip them because there's no point in purchasing the fences unless you're gonna purchase a lot of them, but then that's gonna cost you a lot of money. So if you're still a student like me and you don't wanna spend a lot of money on the game, then I'm sure that you don't purchase the fences because they don't really do a lot of things. And talking about the gnomes, I mean, you guys, honestly, I'm gonna be honest, I never imagined Haiti putting the gnomes into the diamond packs, or not the diamond packs, into the special packs, which still cost money. I just don't get this idea. Now, I'm sure that I do have these decorations already on my farm, so I'm gonna be putting them out. And I actually got them just um, from the usual stuff, like probably from Derby or, um, you know, let's just see if I have, I'm not sure though. Uh, wait, I, I don't? Mm, that's kind of weird. I think I had the flower fences. I don't know. Maybe I'm just using them, guys. It's going to be a bit hard. So let me just go into the edit mode and let me store all the decorations there. And now we can see better. Now we can see if I have the flower fences or not. Uh, there's the trellis fence. Um, wait, I'm, I'm so confused. I don't. Oh, that's weird. That is certainly weird. I really don't have any flower fences. And I was thinking that I do have. Whoops, I don't. But I still don't mind. The fences have never really bothered me. I don't care about fences. But I'm sure I do have the gnomes. I got them from the derby. And I got them from probably other stuff like that. Just the free places. Um, Let me just show you guys the gnomes. I'm not sure where they're going to be. It's going to be kind of hard. So... Maybe we'll just search in here. Um, I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, you can see that I do have a bunch of gnomes. And oh, let me just go back to the edit mode again. And we could just um, find the flower gnomes in here. So, by the way, no hate to the hated team or like anyone. I don't mind them putting the decorations in the special packs. Maybe it was their choice. But I'm just stating my personal opinion. So, yeah, just don't get me wrong on this, please. All right, I'm just going to scroll down, and we're going to see how many flower gnomes I have. Uh, okay, this is getting kind of crazy now. So, where are we? Where are we? Where? Wait, what's happening? you got to be kidding me. All right, guys. Now, you can see here I have four flower gnomes. They're really small, and they're just okay. Personally, I'm not a huge fan of gnomes. I don't really like them. They're just cool. Uh, not only my cup of tea as the decoration in the game. So you can see I already have the flower gnomes and I don't have fences, which I thought I did, but it's okay. I don't really mind that too. So in my opinion, putting these flower gnomes into the packs that you get with the real money, I just don't get the idea. I don't get this concept because uh, that we've missed. I've been purchasing the No Diamond Deco packs literally every month. And we've been getting a lot of cool decorations. We got some big statues as well. But this time, I think it's not worth it. In my opinion, it's really not. So I'm not going to purchase any of these decorations because first, I don't like them. And secondly, they're not attractive to me at all. I'm not a huge gnomes fan and gnomes are really small. If they were big, I might have gotten them. But nope, I'm not going to get them. So that was all about this video, guys. I just wanted to share my personal opinion on this month's diamond pack. It is set with a heavy heart, but this is the first time I'm not liking a special offer in the game. Because usually, I always purchase the special offers, but this time, I think they're really not worth it.
But that's my opinion. You guys might like them. So let me know what you guys think of the special offers. Are you going to get them or not? Um, do you already have these gnomes? If you do, how many flower gnomes do you have? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more handy videos coming. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.